Namaste. So today I have a very special offering for all the women out there, mamas, mamas to be. Um, it's a really safe practice if you are in any stage of pregnancy or postpartum as well. Just really tune into your body um, and notice what it's telling you. If it's asking you to back out, um, just listen, be a witness. So. We're going to move so, through some fluid movements, so really opening up the hips and the side body to begin with. And then we will move into a couple of yin yoga postures. So let's get started. So you can find your way to your seat, bringing the soles of your feet together and maybe just shimmying your hips back slightly just so that the heels are a bit further away from the body, coming into our tortoise. This can feel really nourishing. Um, if you are currently pregnant and it's just really nice for the hips if you um, are not pregnant as well. So you can close your eyes and just start to tune into your breath. Feeling the energy of all the women that have come before us. all the strength and power and beauty. On your next inhale, start to move the body forward. So coming into a spiffy grind and on your exhale, you're kind of doming back. Inhale moves you forward as the chest shines forward. And on your exhale, just really doming the low body, moving in the circular motion, just lubricating the hips. While opening up the chest and the shoulders. So throughout this practice, I just invite you to again, call on that energy of all the women in your life. While at the same time, honoring yourself for wherever you are in your journey. And then you can take that in the opposite direction, just going as slowly or as quickly as you would like here. Really rolling back on your sitting bones on the exhale. Noticing any cracks or pops along the way. At the end of your exhale, coming back to center. From here, just place the hands behind you and guide the knees in towards one another to your tabletop. And just moving through some cat cows here. So on an inhale, the tail and the crown reach towards the sky. And if you are pregnant, hugging baby in here. And on your exhale, really doming out the low back as your chin comes towards your chest. Inhale. Hugging baby in if you are pregnant and if you're not, no worries. Just moving through and enjoying this movement for the spine. So just going through this at your own pace, really, again, moving as slowly or as quickly as you would like.
after your next exhale, you can find your way back to neutral. And then slowly start to guide one hand towards your hips and coming to stand up onto your knees. So I'm just gonna face the camera here. So you can mirror me. So taking your right foot out towards the side and then inhale, reach the arm up and over. Nice side body stretch here. Allow the shoulder of the top arm to soften. Maybe even spiraling your heart. Two deep breaths here. And on your exhale, your left arm comes down towards the mat. As you inhale and lift, the opposite arm up and over. So kind of moving through this bit of a dance here. So inhale, reach. Exhale, open. So beautiful fluid movements. So good for creating space in the body particularly our fascia, just really loves this mixture of movement, lubricating all of the joints of the body. Feel free to kind of do whatever feels good with the arms here. You can get creative. After your next exhale, you can bring your right knee to meet your left and then extending out towards the other side. Inhale, reach the arm up and over. Five deep breaths here as you really open up that side body. Soften the shoulders. Tailbone is navigating down towards the mat so you're not booty popping here. On your exhale, start to move through that little dance. Creating space for breath. For energy to flow more freely throughout your body. Move through this three more times. And at the end of your next exhale, you can bring your hands towards your hips and then guide your left knee now to meet the right. From here, coming back to just your tabletop and then rolling onto the feet, making our way into our malasana, our yogi squat. So taking your feet as wide as you'd like, maybe pointing the toes out and then sinking the booty down. Your elbows are inside of your knees. Maybe you bring your hands towards your heart. Soften the tops of the shoulders. So this posture is just excellent. Really lining up the intestines. And if coming down this low just is not 
serving you today, you can always come to rest your forearms on your thigh. So just coming down to what's comfortable for you. Closing your eyes. Again, bathing in that energy of all the women that have come before us. And if you are pregnant, sending breath down your baby. Filling baby up with energy and light. On your exhale, you can release your hands. Start to straighten your legs, bringing the feet in towards one another, just coming into a forward fold, perhaps with nice deeply bent knees. Shoulders are moving away from your ears. On an inhale, slide the hands up to your shins, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale brings you halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. Fold. Hang out here. Maybe just take some movement side to side. Really allow your head to be nice and heavy. And then making your way to your seat. So perhaps you move your feet out again, coming down through your malasana. And then bringing your hands behind you. So from here, moving into our yin posture. So taking Janu Sarsasana, but we'll take it out towards the side. So bringing your left heel, so mirroring knee, in towards your pelvis. Your leg can be nice and soft, foot can be soft. Inhale, reach the arms up. And on your exhale, start to bring the arms forward. Palms reach up so you're taking any pull or urge to reach out. Just allow your head to be nice and heavy. So you're kind of in this in-between space. You're not facing forward, but you're not facing towards the leg. Really targeting the low back. Connecting with your breath. Connecting with this space of our second chakra. This space of passion and sensuality, creativity, but also the physical space of our reproductive organs, maybe the home of our baby if we are pregnant. So just tuning into this space as we hold. And you will hear my, my voice again soon.
attentive, deep in your breath. Flip the palms and start to press into the hands as you lift yourself up. Maybe keeping your eyes closed or having your gentle gaze and just take a breath here. And on your exhale, you can bring your hands behind you and just switch the legs. So bringing the right heel in towards your pelvis. Just softening this left leg. Inhale, reach the arms up. And on your exhale, taking that sort of angle here, making sure the legs are soft. And then just thinking chin to chest as you begin to fold inward, exploring this ex internal landscape of your being, honoring yourself, Softening your face and your jaw, and especially the space between your eyebrows. Begin to deepen your breath. Palms face the mat as you begin to press yourself back up to a seat. And just taking a breath here. And then bringing your hands behind you, guide the soles of your feet together, coming back into our tortoise posture. So again, moving the sitting bones back slightly so that the heels are a bit further away. Hands towards your shins as you inhale and find some length. And as you exhale, begin to fold forward. So your hands can stay on your shins or you can begin to bring the arms underneath the legs with the palms face up. In here, chin to chest, head heavy. Shoulders are soft and drawing away from your ears. Notice what's going on in your mind. On an exhale, release it and guide it back to your breath.
Start to deepen your breath. Place the palms of the hands on the mat and again, just slide yourself back up to a seat. <clears throat> Crossing the legs in front of you. Inhale, reach the arms. Exhale, hands through heart center. Inhale, arms lift. Again, calling in this energy of all the women surrounding us. Exhale. You can keep your hands here at heart center. If you are currently pregnant, I invite you to bring your hands down towards baby. And whichever variation you are in, you are sending breath down into the space of your heart. Honoring yourself. I share this space with one another virtually sending so much love to you namaste thank you so much for joining me today I wish you a beautiful Mother's Day or celebrating the mothers in your life or just this idea of collective women coming together and sharing space. If you haven't already done so, I would be so honored if you liked and subscribed to my channel and follow me on social media at bliss.yoga. Peace and love. Yoga.